Welcome to Club Rapunzel's Real Hair Talk. I'm Monique, owner of Club Rapunzel, and today I'm sitting down and doing Real Hair Talk with Lisa. Hi guys, I'm Lisa. Lisa is my sister-in-law. Okay, I'm Lisa, I'm a <laughs> stay-at-home mom, busy mother of two. Yes. And she's gonna tell us about her hair journey coming up. Lisa, <laughs> tell us about growing up. What do you remember? Okay, my first memories, a lot of you probably have these memories if you're of a certain age, is the hot comb. My mother would take a, literally take a comb and put it on the stove, <laughs> and then um, it would be smoking, and she would blow <laughs> it, and then she would comb it through your, my hair, and it would be straight. Mm -hmm. And it would stay like that for like a week, but if you were to get it wet, that was it. You, you didn't get it wet. So it was the hot comb. And that was done for years. And then this was like back in the 80s when I was growing up. Everyone, the Jerry Curl just came out. So um, Did you have a Jerry Curl? I had a Jerry Curl. It was, it was everyone had Jerry Curl. <laughs> everyone had Jerry Curls back in the 80s, right? Okay, this is just a history lesson. <laughs> everyone had Jerry Curl. So my aunt literally did my Jerry Curl in her kitchen. And I had that for years until I was a teenager. Would you do a Jerry Curl again? Um, probably not. Well, no, because what's, what's the because it was very it was a lot of products. Like you had to constantly put the activator or moisturizer in it, and it was kind of like greasy and drippy. But <laughs> I will say that my hair grew very long. Like it was the style, and then it was like out of fashion. Uh, so that's kind of why I stopped. Do you remember any mistake that you made with a hairstyle growing up? Um, yes. Well, I was already grown. This wasn't growing up. But um, like a couple years ago, I had braids in my hair. And um, I kept them in for way too long. Mm. So then when I went to take the braids out, for those of you who wear braids, you know at the base, if you have box braids, at the base, You'll get like a buildup of yeah. product and mm. just shed hair, and it's hard, hard to get it out. It's like matted together. So because I had it in so long, I really could not get it out. So I had to like pull it out or cut it out, or my hair just broke off. I left them in all summer. That's like two, three months. You don't want to do that. Even if you're washing your hair and moisturizing it, don't leave it in for so long. Okay, so you're also a mom. Yes. Tell us about doing your kids' hair. Okay, um, I have two kids, a girl and a boy, and they have completely different hair textures. My son, is his hair is just naturally curly and fine. So with him, I can just saturate it with water in the shower, put in a moisturizer or a leave-in conditioner, and his curls just pop, as they say, and he's done. My daughter has, I guess you would call it 4C hair, and um, it's really a challenge. It would take me an hour just to comb it and then another half an hour to style it. So I finally bit the bullet and gave her a texturizer. So now I can just comb through it and I do twists. I do a lot of braids with her. She likes to have her hair, she calls it free and flowing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'll just like put a headband on it and just let it be free and flowing. She mm -hmm. has like shoulder length hair and she loves to have her hair out. So I'll just have it out um, or braids or twists. I used to do the beads and all that, but she's getting older. She just wants it out. Out and living out and free. Out living free. <laughs> so that's what we do now. Thanks, Lisa, for hair sharing with Club Rapunzel's Real Hair Talk today. You're welcome. Happy Thanksgiving, guys. It's Thanksgiving today. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving. So we're thankful that you shared with us. We're thankful for our Club Rapunzel crew. And if you're interested in starting or continuing your healthy hair journey, Go to clubrapunzel.com and pick a three, six, or 12 month hair repair and growth challenge. Share your stories with us, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. bye. bye.